Welcome back. You're still on to Wake Up Nigeria, guys. And we are in the kitchen. And Chef Blossom is our chef for today. Hello, Blossom. Good morning. How are you doing today? Guess what, people? She is making something hot, steamy, and spicy on the show today. What are you making for us? Okay, today I'll be making catfish pepper soup. Catfish pepper soup. Yes. Hmm. Some people are still in the holiday oh, yes, mood, yes. you know, getting ready as we, you know, nod into the new year. And cast fish pepper soup is, it's not difficult to make. It's very easy very to easy make, to actually. Make, yes. Okay, so let's run through the ingredients quickly. Okay, um, good morning, everyone. We have um, our catfish here. Mm -hmm. We have our plantain. Yeah. Our plantain. As it serves as a take now for the um, catfish. For the soup. For this yes. pepper soup, yeah. Yes. So we have our onions, we have our scent leaf, and our pepper, then our seasoning to taste. Mm. Very, 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 not too many um, ingredients we're working with today. And um, so, how do we begin? Okay, we begin by adding our water. Okay. Um, we have water down here, so we could just, you know, pour it in. And, um, all right, so the Christmas holiday is finally over. I would like to know, what did you make? Anyways, right there on your screen are the ingredients we're working with this morning for our catfish pepper soup. We have our catfish, crayfish, unripe plantain, pepper soup spice, scotch bonnet, and we have our onions, and we have our scent leaf. I'm sure, I'm guessing the scent leaf is the last thing to put in here. Thing yes. that's going to go into our catfish pepper soup. All right, so apart from plantain, is there any other, you know, ingredients you can use as a thickener? Yes, you can as well use your yam. Yam. Yes. Mm. Some persons like to use corn flour, but I don't really think because mm. I like it when it's very natural. Okay, okay, so okay. Yeah, corn yam. flour. Mm. But I think I, if, I, if I were to, you know, if I were to pick one, I think I'll go with yam. Yam. Okay, yeah. why, why is that? Bec well, I don't know, because, you know, I'm, I'm from Ibibio. Okay. I'm Ibibio, actually. I'm from Aquaibom State, and mm. we make pounded yam soup. We have a pounded mm. yam soup. Okay. white soup and we use yam in also making it okay. and it's actually the same you know process it's the same you know procedure process when making you know fish pepper soup yeah i think um why most persons like to use plantain is because it's very the process is very easy easy oh, you, know, you okay. don't have to go all the way to peel your yam okay and, you know cut and all of that i think so. the delta people also use plantain they have a, a particular meal they call theirs i think it's okowo or okowo. something like that yeah I think it's mostly the ripe plantain they use. Oh, ripe plantain. Yeah, ripe plantain oh, yes. Okay. So right now we're waiting for uh, water to get water to get yes. Okay. Now let's talk about, there's a certain technique that comes with washing the catfish. Yes. How do you wash your catfish? Okay. Um, there are two ways. All right. So let's hold that thoughts and you watching has to stay tuned. Next up we have... Our relationship expert Tehilia Idowu and she is with Titi on the couch. Hey ladies. Here on Wake Up Nigeria, of course here with me in the kitchen this morning is Chef Blossom. Hey. 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 All right this morning she's steaming up our taste buds and the studio and we are making catfish pepper soup this morning. Now let's talk about the ingredients we're working with. All right um we have our catfish here. Mm -hmm. We have our onions and our scent leaf. We have our seasoning. seasoning. We have our scotch bonnet. <clears throat> we have our spice. Yes. Cat pepper soup spice. Yes. Then we have our salt to taste. And then we have our ripe plantain, which is cooking, cooking already. already. Yes. Great. Now what's next? Because that plantain has been cooking okay. for a while. Yes. But it was important for let you for, for to wait to let you in on the process for this catfish pepper soup because it's important that you know you join us in this cooking process yes. right now what's next okay now we're putting in our fish all right catfish all right so earlier on before we went on a quick break um you were telling us the method you use in washing, washing the fish yes. yes yes um i like to wash with um alum alum oh, okay to take away all that the slime slippery, yeah the it. slime okay yes. Also, some persons like to use um, lime. Oh. Lime also works for the okay. same purpose, yes. Because of its acidity? Yes. Okay, great, great. All right, great stuff. 
If you're just joining us, the ingredients we are working with this morning are on your screen right now. We have our seasoning cube, our onions, scent leaf, our blended pepper. We have our pepper soup spice, salt, catfish, and unripe plantain. Okay. Now, there's your catfish spice. Did okay. you make it yourself? Yes, I mixed myself. Okay. Now, tell us how you put that, you know, this spice together. Okay. Um, it's a combination of a lot of spice okay like um we have uzuza mm. this that's the uzuza leaf or the seed the seed, the seed. Oh. seed. Oh. um and also ehuru there's this ehuru. other seed Ooh. we use oh, okay it's ehuru, mostly known by the yeah. ebos yes ehuru yes them. it's it has a certain you know flavor, flavor it, gives. it gives to whatever you use oh yes. nice 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 you see we're working here with a lot of natural spices here and also we show. also have in here we have a dried ginger Oh, dry ginger. Yes. Oh, okay. And um, garlic. Mm. And I have a bit of crayfish in it oh, as well. So you blended everything together. together. Yes. Okay. Hmm. Now that's a teaser for you guys. Hmm. Should we do a giveaway? I mean, we're wrapping up 2020 <laughs> with all smiles and jolliness and good food, of course. So maybe we should ask your question. All right. So let's run through the um, ingredients you we are using for our pepper soup spice this morning and if you get it who knows chef blossom might just prepare you something special <laughs> for true. the new year okay. are we good all right so now let's go through it again and then we'll ask our viewers the question okay we already have our plantain pots. no i'm talking of our pepper soup spice okay the spice the ingredients okay. We okay. Use okay for our pepper soup spice okay i said um we have uh uses acid mm -hmm. in here Blended, of course. Yes. We have the ehuru. Ehuru. So, say a seed. Mm -hmm. And then we have crayfish. In crayfish. It. We also have our dried ginger. Yeah. And, and garlic. Garlic. Yeah. And that's it. That's so, it. what are the ingredients we used in making our pepper soup spice this morning? Chef Lawson put together some good looking, um, delicious natural spices together in our pepper soup spice. So, what are the ingredients? She's mentioned them twice. So if you get it, you can get a special dish from Chef Blossom. You can reach out to us on all our social media platforms at TVC Connect. Use the hashtag Wake Up Nigeria. We would like to hear from you. And that's it for now on the show. There's still so much more to come, guys. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Thank you very much we're still here in the kitchen and chef blossom is here so earlier on we asked a question and surprisingly we have people already sending in their answers ah, super excited i'll read them out later but let's tell you what we are making in the kitchen this morning if you're just joining us this is chef blossom and we are making cat fish pepper, pepper soup. soup yes i know it's hot and steaming in here in the studio i'm pretty excited about this morning's recipe but quickly chef blossom tell us how you put this together okay first we had our water boiling mm -hmm. then we put in our plantain our red plantain of course so we allow to boil for like let's say five minutes okay then we put in the fish um the catfish then um our onions also our pepper then the spice, the um, pepper soup spice. Mm -hmm. And um, lastly, we put in our scent leaf. Yes. And our oh, sorry, catfish ahead. pepper soup is and seasoning. ready. Yes. Seasoning, yes. Ta da! <laughs> there you have it. Looking really, really, really nice. Mm, and it smells delicious yeah, too. Sure it yes. So, earlier when I asked you, what are the ingredients that Chef Blossom used in her pepper soup spice? And surprisingly, we have a few answers, and they are not on your screen, guys. No, they are not on your screen. Yes, so I'm just going to um, call, read out. Um, we have a few answers here. We have at Ademary124734, um, and she said, Nzuza seed, Ihuru seed, dry ginger, and garlic. But you missed out one Some other ingredient. But we have another um, person here, Princess Lucy at Lucy underscore Prince. She actually got the answers correctly. And she was actually the first person to send in her answer. She said, um, catfish pepper soup spice ingredients, uzuza leaves, uzuza seeds, sorry, ihuru, ginger, garlic, and crayfish. Yay! 
Yeah, That's yeah. Good. Thank you so much, Princess Lucy, for sending in your answers. You are our winner for today. And Chef Blossom would definitely reach out to you. Definitely. On through me. So just send me a DM and then we'll talk and then we'll get your prize over to you. It's a surprise, so fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. But you can be very rest assured that it's something delicious and really, really good as mm. well. All right. And there's still um, so much happening here on the show, people. Our catfish pepper soup is almost ready. And so Chef Blossom also mentioned earlier on that you can use yam to make um, your catfish pepper soup. Serve if you as don't, thickener. Yeah, to serve soup. as a thickener if you don't want to yes. use plantains. Um, is there any other thing you can use? And also, use? You, you could also use the same process to make your goat meat pepper soup. Ooh, also, yes. Yeah. But any kind of protein you want to use for your turkey pepper soup, your chicken pepper soup, because you same process. Mm, nice. I'm definitely going to make this on New Year's Day. But please, don't reach out to me saying, can I visit? No visitors. <laughs> COVID-19 protocols. <laughs> All right, so we still have social media um, updates coming up on the couch with Titi, Tokwe, and Mary. Hey, ladies. Welcome to the kitchen. Calabachi. This way. Okay. Welcome. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi, Mary. Hi, Ellen. Hi, Hi, Hi. Hi. <laughs> Yes, welcome okay. to the kitchen. Mm -hmm. And um, this is Chef Blossom. And this morning, she is going to steam up those taste buds mm. with catfish mm. pepper soup. I hope you are ready. <laughs> She's no. not even ready. She's <laughs> restless. I'm all ready. She's like, oh my gosh. All right, so please, um, here you go. All right. Enjoy. Ooh. Okay, now and let us know. some boiled plantain in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Love so, love Chef Blossom, quickly I tell us how you put that together while she um, has a taste. Okay, um, we have our catfish. Um, Ooh. Also our Ooh. ripe plantain and ripe plantain. Then we have Ooh. our spice, pressed spice. <laughs> and also we have onions, scent leaf, and um, yeah, that's it. Season to taste. So All tell right. us, Kalabachik. <laughs> All right. Now I miss my mom. Oh. <laughs> so what do you think? What do you think? What do you think? This is really, it's really tasty. Okay. It's spicy mm. as pepper soup should be. Yeah. So people don't know how to prepare pepper soup. Pepper soup. It's like, oh. this is what you taste. Like, Where is it? Pepper in your pepper soup. <laughs> <laughs> this is spicy. Amazing. And the plantain is well cooked. Well cooked. Look at that analysis. It's, not, it's, it's there. It's just... It's you know, it's perfect. On point, perfect. Um, mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Chef Blossom. Yeah. Where can they reach out to you on social media? You can reach out to me on Blossom Spot on Instagram. Blossom Spot on Instagram. Yes. All right. And then we also have a few winners, so reach out to Blossom Spot on Instagram. Instagram. Yes. Sir. And then we should get back to you. All right. Now it's been a very tasty, tantalizing Wonder Woman Wednesday <laughs> today. <laughs> and the week is not <laughs> over. The year is not over yet. There's still one more day. I think the, the toughest the part is yeah. accepting that this show is over today. Yeah. Oh. yeah. But it's okay. We feel your pain as much we, we as we Remember we have to our song. Oh, we're in the world, girls. I promise I can't get used to it. Thank you so much for watching. Have a